Hi, my name is Jonathan Gonzalez, and today I'm going to be vlogging about how to make three different types of sandwiches. A cheese sandwich, a peanut butter sandwich, and a bread sandwich. And I'll also be tasting testing them afterwards and rating them uh, from three to one. Three being the worst and one being the best. To make a peanut butter sandwich, you'll need three things. Some peanut butter. Uh, preferably, I like pe Peter Pan uh, creamy peanut butter because that's my preference. And a spoon so you could smear the peanut butter uh, on the sandwich. And two slices of bread. So first what you want to do is you want to open up the peanut butter. Uh, get your spoon and just get some peanut butter out from under there. And then place the peanut butter on a sandwich and basically spread it around so you have even amounts of peanut butter all in the sandwich so it doesn't like overpower uh, some of the other sides it feels a bit too much when you're eating it so I'm just getting some more on here and I think one more scoop of peanut butter should do it Alright, so then what you're going to want to do is grab the other slice of bread and then put it on top of the sandwich and then you sort of want to press all around on the sandwich so you make sure that it stays in touch and there you go, that's how you make a peanut butter sandwich. I'll be taste testing that later after I make the next two. If you want to make something more simpler and that doesn't have a lot of instructions, uh, I recommend a cheese sandwich. All you need is two slices of bread again and some cheese. Uh, I got some American cheese from Publix Deli because Publix is a pretty cool place to get some cheese from. So what you'll want to do is, uh, preferably I like to get uh, two slices of cheese for at least one sandwich. So I'm going to get the first slice here. Uh, put on a sandwich. It doesn't matter which piece of bread you put it on. I'm going to get the second slice here. Oh, messing up a bit. Ignore that. <laughs> it's hard to get it out. And like that. And then what you want to do, same thing as the peanut butter sandwich, put the other piece of bread on it. And yeah, there you go. That's how you make a cheese sandwich. And last but not least, I'll show you how to make the last but not least uh, supply <sighs> surprise sandwich. For the final sandwich, and this is probably the most simplest out of all of them, like anyone can do this. Three slices of bread is all you need to make this legendary sandwich. So what you want to do carefully, and I mean really carefully, is put the first slice of bread on top of the second slice. And then grab the other one really gently, and voila, you have a bread sandwich. It's probably like the most amazing thing in the world, honestly. I'm just... I can't even describe it. It's so amazing. But, yeah, I'll be taste testing all three of them, including this one, later, and giving my thoughts, how it tastes, and how I rate it. Now that we're done making the sandwiches, let's taste test them. First, we're going to try out the peanut butter sandwich. It tastes pretty uh, bland and kind of creamy. I'll uh, rate it number three. Next we have the cheese sandwich. It tastes a bit better, but uh, not really creamy, so I'll uh, rate it number two. And last but not least, we have the bread sandwich. It's probably the best one out of all of them. has the most flavor, not too creamy, and honestly it's just my personal favorite so I'm gonna read it number one. But thank you guys for watching my vlog and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye.